of six right now. The state's unemployment rate is down compared with the early stages of the pandemic. Yeah, but there are still a lot of job openings out there, including at the Horseshoe Casino in Baltimore. WMAR 2 News' Mark Roper is live outside the casino for us this morning where there is a job fair today. So, Mark, what do people need to know before they attend the job fair? Good morning, Megan and Christian. There are a lot of opportunities here. There are full-time jobs, part-time jobs, and on-call jobs available here at the Horseshoe Casino. And I'm here with the Vice President of Marketing, Tom York, to find out some of the details. So tell us about what are some of the jobs that you have available at the job fair today? Absolutely. Honestly, it runs the gamut. So from, you know, we, we're looking for a ton of dealers. You want to be on our slots department. You want to work in IT or marketing. Uh, we're hiring just about anybody. And the great thing about a horseshoe is we don't hire based on experience. We hire based on attitude. So you come in here with a great attitude and you want a, a career here in the casino, we're ready to hire you on the spot as soon as you get here. And how much of uh, an effect did the pandemic have on staffing here? Obviously, you're having the job fair here today. Are you looking to fill a lot of those positions that went away or hoping some of those old people come back? Uh, the, the great news is, is none of the positions really went away. Uh, we're actually hiring brand new positions post-pandemic. Uh, the customers are ready to come back, and we want to be able to serve them. But, I mean, did people, did, uh, not that you got rid of positions, but did people leave and you're looking to refill some of those positions or old people coming back? Or Yeah, a little bit of that, but at the same time, uh, we're seeing just folks are ready to come out, uh, have a little fun with us. Uh, at the same time, we, we want to be able to serve them better. So we need actually more folks than what we had before the pandemic. And as you said, people really don't need to have prior experience to get a job here. No, you, you come in here with a great attitude. We will train you for a couple of weeks to make sure you're comfortable on the casino floor. But at the same time, just be positive and happy and you can make a great career here with no experience. And so what would the hiring process be like here today? Like how soon could someone actually get started? I mean, you, we're going to start our hiring event at 2 o'clock today and then you can get an offer at 2.05. So it, it's very, very quick. You'll get an offer on the spot to start your career here with Horseshoe. And um, what do people need to know when they show up here, like dress to impress? Uh, what kind of tips do you have? Yeah, it's, it's always dress for the job you want, not the job you have. So, I mean, uh, yeah, definitely come, come in uh, with your best. But at the same time, uh, we're ready to hire folks from Baltimore City that are looking for jobs. And one important question a lot of people want to know is what's the pay like? Uh, the pay's pretty good. We're, uh, if you're a dealer, you can walk in here 50 plus thousand dollars a year. Uh, again, that's all based on your attitude and just being positive. And do you have any hiring incentives? Uh, we do have hiring incentives uh, as far as, you know, short term and long term. Uh, as, the longer you stay, the more money in your pocket. And how many positions do you have available to fill? Like, what are, what are the chances of getting hired? Your chances are very good. I mean, we're looking for 100 plus dealers as well as the rest of the entire property is looking for employees. So, uh, again, you come in here happy and we're going to bring you help. That's great. Thanks a lot for joining us this morning, Tom. So you heard it. There is a job fair here at the Horseshoe today and Wednesday. It starts at 2 and runs until 6 o'clock. Just show up here at the Horseshoe, go to the Harbor Room, and good luck. Reporting live in downtown Baltimore, Mark Roper, WMAR2 News. All right. Sounds like you can walk out of there with a job today.